The launch of the James Webb Space Telescope, JWST, has marked the beginning of a new era in astronomy, as declared by former NASA science director Thomas Sir Butchin. The telescope, often referred to as Webb, promises to test and extend our understanding of planets, the origins of life, and our cosmology. However, what began as a monumental achievement soon descended into chaos as scientists grappled with Webb's groundbreaking discoveries. These findings have plunged cosmology into a major crisis, reminiscent of the upheaval experienced during the Middle Ages when the heliocentric model of the universe was proposed. Webb's discoveries have challenged long-standing theories and measurements, causing significant disruptions in our understanding of the universe. The foundation of modern astrophysics is built on principles that date back to antiquity and were further developed during the Middle Ages, particularly by Sir Isaac Newton. Newton's laws of gravity and motion have been the bedrock of our scientific exploration of the cosmos. However, as our observational capabilities expanded, inconsistencies began to emerge between these principles and the new data collected from space. One of the major crises that have arisen is known as the Hubble tension. This issue stems from the conflicting measurements of the age and expansion rate of the universe. Local measurements, based on astronomical objects within the universe, differ from measurements of the early universe based on the cosmic microwave background radiation. This dissonance has raised questions about the validity of the Hubble constant, which indicates the universe's expansion rate. Webb's discovery of numerous old and highly developed galaxies in space has further fueled these doubts. These galaxies appear so mature that their existence challenges the established age of the universe, suggesting that the universe may be older than the currently accepted 13.8 billion years. The observations made by Webb have revealed galaxies that seem to have formed and developed in a much shorter time frame than previously thought possible. According to current cosmological models, galaxies need billions of years to evolve. However, the galaxies observed by Webb appear fully formed just 200 million years after the Big Bang. This paradox implies that either our understanding of galaxy formation is flawed or that the Big Bang theory itself may need revision. The discovery has sparked intense debates among scientists, with some arguing that our earthly physics cannot be universally applied while others believe we have only scratched the surface of the true nature of the cosmos. The ancient scholar Hermes Trismegistus once said, As in small things, so in great things. According to this maxim, the physics that govern the cosmos should also be observable on Earth. However, Webb's discoveries suggest that we may have overlooked forces and dimensions on our planet that are now becoming apparent in the universe. Webb's advanced technology allows it to detect extremely faint light signals from distant galaxies, some of which have traveled through space and time for over 13 billion years. These observations have provided a new perspective on the early universe, revealing galaxies that contradict our current understanding of cosmic evolution. Webb's capabilities have led to the identification of highly developed galaxies that existed shortly after the Big Bang creating a significant challenge for traditional cosmological models. Instead of finding, baby, galaxies, Webb has shown us mature galaxies, raising questions about the timeline and processes of galaxy formation. This has forced the scientific community to reconsider the validity of long-held theories. The realization that our standard cosmological model, which has guided our understanding of the universe for about a century, might be fundamentally flawed is a bitter pill for many scientists to swallow. The resistance to new ideas is not new in the scientific community. Historically, groundbreaking discoveries have often faced opposition. For instance, during the Middle Ages, the shift from the geocentric to the heliocentric model of the universe met with significant resistance from the church and traditionalists. Today, while researchers who propose new ideas are not imprisoned like Galileo. They still face considerable opposition. This resistance can be attributed to the natural human tendency to cling to familiar concepts and the substantial investment many scientists have made in existing theories. Despite resistance, 
Young scientists like Rowan Naidu and Stephen Finkelstein are embracing Webb's discoveries with enthusiasm. They stress the importance of open-mindedness in a field where understanding is evolving. With Catch New Dataset, they cagily anticipate exploring the fresh insights Webb offers. The debate in modern cosmology centers on the Hubble constant and universe expansion. Edwin Hubble's 1920s discovery that distant galaxies move away suggested expansion, later forming the Big Bang theory. Alternative methods propose varied galaxy movements, offering coherent explanations often overshadowed by the Big Bang. Webb's observations reveal regions where cosmic expansion varies, leading to speculation about multiple starting points or sources for the universe. These findings challenge the singular Big Bang theory and suggest a more complex universe than previously thought. As the scientific community tackles these challenges, Webb's ongoing mission offers hope for clarity. Its precise measurements could resolve the Hubble tension and lead to advanced physics. While some researchers quickly adapt to new findings, others take longer, reflecting the rigorous and diverse process of scientific progress. We must approach Webb's discoveries with an open mind, exploring alternative explanations and embracing new knowledge. Instead of blaming past misunderstandings, we should focus on advancing our understanding. Webb's findings could revolutionize our view of the cosmos, requiring the scientific community to revise long-held beliefs. British scientist Roger Penrose's theory suggesting the universe cycles through creation and destruction with black holes as key information stores, is gaining renewed interest due to Webb's findings. Once fringe, Penrose's ideas now highlight the potential greater role of black holes in the universe's evolution. Webb's mission is just beginning, yet its discoveries are already challenging our understanding of the universe. The telescope's detailed observations are opening new research avenues from exploring exoplanets and discovering new worlds, to studying our solar system and the largest cosmic structures. Webb is providing valuable data that will shape the future of astrophysics. Each observation from Webb adds to our understanding of the universe, uncovering unknown forces and phenomena that challenge existing theories. This process of discovery and revision drives scientific progress. While unsettling, Webb's revolution offers a valuable opportunity to expand our knowledge and deepen our understanding of the cosmos. In conclusion, the James Webb Space Telescope is revolutionizing astronomy, challenging long-standing theorics and sparking intense debates. While this upheaval may be tumultuous, it highlights the dynamic nature of scientific inquiry. As Webb continues to explore the universe, we can anticipate groundbreaking insights and a deeper understanding of the cosmos. Thank you for watching another episode of Alizeb. While you are still here, don't forget to like and subscribe.